Okay, another useful feature that can get students engaged, can get them uh, talking to each other, can get them debating with you, can get them discussing topics, is the, is the forum option in Moodle. And Mr. and Mrs. Ofsted really like forum. They also really like glossary. Because this shows that students can, are actually doing stuff. They're talking to each other. It's peer-to-peer -peer learning. They're uploading material. And they get, they're getting involved with the subject and, um, and engaging with the teacher. And so, so this, is, this, is, this is forum. Now, there's a very simple operation is, again, you go to add an activity and resource. And you click on add forum. There are many different aspects of forum. You can get students to put up one topic. You can put up a topic and get them to comment on it. You can have forums where they can only say one thing or two things or three things. Or you can have an open forum for general use. And that tends to be the favorite one, because that allows people um, to engage not only with what you've suggested and said, but also what other people have said. So you get students debating amongst themselves, as well as um, bouncing off the topic that the teacher might have suggested. So this forum name, I'm going to put, I'm going to call it, what do you find funny? Now, it would be possible to, um, they've got standard forum for general use on that. It would be possible to just leave it at that and just come up with, well, I find, I find the early works of John Cleese incredibly funny, or I like Buster Keaton or whatever. But what you can also do to, um, if you like, heighten engagement, you can put up a video or embed a video onto the forum to get people discussing around what they find funny. Now, um, in order to do that, you need to go to YouTube. You need to search for um, what, you, uh, what you want, and you go to share. And eventually, this little link comes up down here. You copy, and you paste into the forum. You can do this with anything you like. Any YouTube video you can do it. You can do it with Vine as well. But YouTube, YouTube says you copy, you share, you drop it in to the uh, video there. And you must click display description on course page. So I've clicked that, that there, and that will show it on the page. And then I'm going to save and return to course. Now, the particular video I found on there was one of a, uh, a gentleman falling over, because I think it's funny when people fall over sometimes. But there you go. So there you go. Steve Gerard falling off a podium is something that I find really funny. But if you find something else funny, you can just click on the um, click on the thing there, and you've got down the bottom here. You have add a new discussion topic, and you could say, "Well, I don't think that's funny at all. I don't think it's funny at all. What I find funny is um, Black Out of the Fourth, or I particularly like the Real McCoy that was a TV show in the 90s in London." The, the point is, you can you can comment on what has been put up there originally, or you can add a completely new discussion topic, and just say. I think cartoons are funny or anything else. Um, I'll just show you how to do that. Subject. Whoops. Remember, again, there's no spell check in uh, Moodle, so it might be a good idea. You can also add, upload pictures there if you want. And you post a forum, and that's gone on there. And then again, any student, anybody on the course can add to that. Oh, your post was successfully added. Thank you very much, because it needs to be successful. And it tells you that. And it will also, you can set it up so it will email people if you add posts or not. That's entirely, that's your choice. There's, there's lots of ways you can play around with forum, but embedding a video and getting students to comment on it, getting students to debate on it, is a really useful means of using it. So go for it.